Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Christy, and we have a new series starting today, a chill series. I am doing a Townie Stories series. Okay, Penny, where are you going? But I have never played with the Townies in The Sims 4. I've played with them in previous gener or previous games, but I thought, you know, why not? Especially with my mods, we can see what the world gets up to. So my plan is to play different townies for a few sim days. Each episode will be a different family and just see what happens in the world. Something chill, no um, fixed storylines or having to go through the generations and legacy. And yeah, I'm just kind of curious on how it would go. So we're starting off with Penny. Figure we'll start off with a single sim here. She has, she's neutral to becoming pregnant, just discovered she is socially gifted. And I gave her two more traits because she is outgoing, ambitious, romantic. And I gave her envious and high maintenance. Oh, and she also learned she is not creative. I feel like she would be creative, but oh well. So if you're curious about this and want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button and please like this video. Leave any comments on what you think down below. So the one thing doing this after just a couple some days, the world's going to change completely with MC Command Center. So I'm curious on who gets married to who, who starts having babies. I am on long lifespan so we can get through more families and pregnancy is set at six days with wonderful whims. But we're going to kind of work on Penny's stuff, her aspiration and her job. She only knows her landlord, so I want to build relationships with Sims all throughout the world and see if more drama can happen that way. So she is a level eight of her career, but has absolutely no followers. So maybe, maybe we should get on that. Here, why don't you add to your Simpsagram story? And then you want to introduce yourself to someone new in three different city neighborhoods. Well, let's do that right now in your own neighborhood. Here we have this Alice Martin person. Come give a cheerful introduction. And we got a little mini protest by Dwayne out here. Of course, since we come out here, it starts raining. Oh, but you guys like each other. You think she's sophisticated. Oh, yeah, it's storming now. Um, but exchange names, you know, oh, never mind, you are running home. Okay, at least we met one person, and you do work tomorrow, so we should probably set up a social media profile. Yep, create a social media profile so you can work on your job a little bit. Why don't you start a funny meme? Let's see how that goes. <laughs> Alright, we have 15,000 followers now. That was great. And then... Oh, you're updating your social media status. You want to broadcast your status. All right, hurry up and update so we can broadcast status. Does that reach more people? Okay, we only gained 15 with that. And you need 10 million followers. That is a long way to go. I don't think we're going to get you promoted. All right, 9,000. You're doing pretty well. Here, come use a toilet. You want to buy a massage table. She is... I use the downloaded high maintenance trait I have. I have never used the one in game, but I really liked this one. Okay, and we do want to get food from food stalls, so I think we'll do that in a little bit. I know it's raining now, but we'll go to another neighborhood, try to introduce yourself to someone else, and you just want to watch different streams. Okay, it's like I've been in this apartment a couple times with like my sims visiting. I didn't realize how awkward it is. Like, this giant TV on a coffee table. And then, or, kind of like a... This table feels too fancy for this area. But we'll maybe try to do a little bit of upgrading to her apartment when we have money. But yeah, let's go ahead and travel to another area of the city. Alright, we're at one of the karaoke bars. I don't know if there's going to be... Oh, the food stalls aren't open. Okay, we'll see if they open up, but why don't you, like, come inside? 
And maybe meet this Emmett Wortley. He's cute. Do a cheerful introduction to him. Oh my gosh, the rain is so loud. Okay, and you have a crush on him. Ooh. So he thinks you are responsible. Oh, he's married. Mm, never mind. We should not break up any marriages to start. Here, let's meet Miko. Okay, she's getting along with everyone. I mean, she is outgoing, so people are gonna like her. And you, okay, you want to send a text. I know it's from being romantic, but we're gonna say it's a friendly text. Just send a happy text to Alice, which will probably mean she's gonna invite us somewhere, but, oh, the food stalls are open now. Okay, come order, um, maybe a tomato-wrapped veggie burrito? Okay, yeah, but she's inviting us out to a cafe, but we need to get our food. Okay, she is just super happy. Mine is a storm and you're all wet. But she is a feeler. She hears like hears people, wants to make sure that they are present and having conversations. Everyone feels heard. Okay, there's... Okay, Luna, I don't think like the paint's going to stick in the rain. Okay, since we're down here, maybe you could just sing a solo. Do, ooh, do a pop song. Oh, I think Eliza wants to take over. And we'll also have you change into another outfit. Um, I did add a couple outfits for her. And normally I do, like, Elsa hairs and um, all that. But for this save, I will stick with Max's match just to keep the world cohesive and not have to give everyone makeovers. Alright, we have some celebrities showing up, so it's be good to meet people. Everyone's here. And oh, we have, what is this? Um, yeah, Yuki, she is watching us. She doesn't seem impressed. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and like get a drink. Here, order your favorite drink. So she is envious and she gets mad when seeing other Sims being so happy, but you're so happy. Okay, you got a lot of cocolata. Ooh. So this is one of the outfits I gave her. And I also did make her a little bit shorter. I feel like she would be small. Here, let's make more friends. Uh, do a friendly introduction to Nilani. You want to know, like, you're a social media person. You need to know everyone. Oh, she is not, like, she doesn't have a good first impression of Nilani, a nature maniac. And yeah, I guess living in the city might not be that into nature. Oh, there is a karaoke contest. Ooh. So maybe we should do that. Are there any other... Or any that are open? No, maybe um, Julia will be finished soon. Oh, here's an open one. Sing in the karaoke contest. Do shaken, not stirred. We gotta finish your drink. Hurry up. Alright, she is feeling good. She's ready to win this. I love grabbing people's attention, of course. Like, you're not very good, but you're putting in good effort. And it's like, I can't really hear over, um, Mickey, or Miko. Okay, now we can hear you. Okay, you're feeling so confident from being the center of attention. You are feeling a little tense because, you know, you are high maintenance. And, I don't know, are you, I feel like you should be an extrovert. Yes, you are an extrovert. Oh, you got 44 out of 100. I don't think that's good. Here, come and uh, use the toilet. Alright, she is feeling flirty, but I don't think there's any eligible men for her. I think everyone's pretty much married. Oh, but it's not raining anymore. Hmm. Okay, it's kind of dead out here, so everyone is at the karaoke contest. And the winner will be announced at 11, so we have to stick around. Uh, maybe you meet this Adam guy. Oh, you guys, yeah, don't really like each other. Never mind about that. I thought maybe she had a thing for, like, redheads. But there is Marcus here, and we have Cameron. 
So we're just introducing ourselves to everyone. Okay, she likes him. He's admirable. Not everyone's gonna know you are pretty thirsty tonight. Look at how red you are. And who else has shown up? Oh, we got Travis Scott. Okay, and Anaya Jang won. She had a score of 61. Well, you, you did some good work. We'll have your drink sweet and spicy and then go home because you do a work tomorrow at 10 a.m. Although, Travis, he sounds pretty good. Yeah, he's feel, he should have entered the contest. You probably would have won. So she thinks Cameron is very attractive. Ooh. Well, maybe he will give us a call or something. But all right, let's go home and get ready for work. All right, I do want to replace her bed because this one is super cheap and ugly. Get her something that she'll actually feel rested in. Here we go. I think this will be much better. Yeah, you'll get much better energy with this. So why don't you get to sleep? Oh, we gotta do auto lights. Save a little bit of, on your money. And then we'll join her in the morning when she gets ready for work. All right, Penny is up and she is hungover. No more drinking. I made a fool of myself. No, you had fun. It was fine. So she's going to make a fruit salad. And you want to shop out a cart. Well, I don't know if there's um, any in this neighborhood where you can, oh, in the buildings where you can buy like produce. But she doesn't like that she is cooking. She does have a high cooking skill. But she feels like, you know, she's too good to cook. So from now on, we should probably, like, order deliveries or go to the food stalls. But, I mean, they're not open right now. Oh, yeah, and she made, like, a gross salad, too. But her, I mean, her cooking's level 7. But she is just, she just couldn't be bothered. And now you're going to be upset that your salad is bad. All right, we're going to send Penny into work. Um, today and then maybe tomorrow we'll have her work from home. So I feel like before we go in, she's chatting with someone. I'm not sure who, but I feel like we should, you know, do a little bit of our networking. Maybe just update your social media status, and then if we have time, you know, promote an image. Okay, that gave us only 20 followers, and now you are tense again. Okay, we're better. Minty fresh teeth. Oh, embarrassing comments ruin images like that. Thanks, Mom. Penny has gained zero followers. Oh, at least you didn't lose any. But she's off to work. Oh, but Emmett, the bartender we met, wants to get, wants to get to know Takashi Fuji a little better as a friend. Um, yeah, you know, building friendships is a must. All right, we made a thousand bucks. Good. But now we need to still introduce ourselves to another sim. We need to go to another part of the city. All right, we're at the art gallery and let's see who is here. We have a bartender here. Oh, Don's a bartender. Okay, you want to, oh, you're gonna go chat with Baco. Well, introduce yourself. Pretty sure you're married, so you're gonna be a no-go. Okay, there we go. We have introduced ourselves to people in three neighborhoods. Okay, she is practicing flirting. So we should probably, like, find her a date. Oh, there's Angela Pleasant. She is all ready to do some painting. Okay, I guess maybe we'll introduce ourselves to Don. We'll see what she thinks of him. Okay, she thinks he's interesting. Uh, Bass, okay, we will... We'll do some goodwill. We'll donate one simoleon. Okay, and you think he is attractive. Oh, yeah, Sergio Ramo, or Ramo, Romeo, who's over here. So we get her, I want options. Maybe one of them will, like, ask her on a date. Okay, she thinks he is attractive as well. Yeah, she's getting along with pretty much everyone. So, okay, I don't think this food stall's opening. That's a bit annoying. Uh, anything else? Anyone else showing up? Okay, apparently she is done talking to the boys. And she's just feeling happy. She's not in a flirty mood yet. 
but she does want to use a bubble blower, so why don't you try it out? Apparently someone told her they love her, and she feels so good about that. I'm guessing it was more like a friendship type thing, but you do like the bubble blower. Alright, who's our... oh, Malcolm. Mm, maybe not Malcolm. It looks like we have a little play date going on. They don't, they don't like the bubble blower. We got Nanami and Lucas Munch. Oh, Sergio, Sergio has come and joined us. Now ask about his day. And she does want to flirt with someone. I kind of want her to do it on her own. See who she likes, but doesn't seem to be happening. Oh, the food stall is open now. All right, let's oh, not order a drink. Oh, no, I guess it's just drinks. That's fine. Uh, why don't you do a green tea? Oh, I think this guy, Adam, might be creepy. She is, like, creeped out by someone. I think it's getting a little bit late, so let's go home. You'll work tomorrow. I think we'll order a delivery so you don't have to cook. Okay, what kind of food does she want ordered? Want to order? We'll do, like, a poke bowl. We'll get a couple things. Maybe something for tomorrow. Uh, maybe Capri salad and a BLT. Our, our food is here, so accept it. She's cute. It's kind of weird that they like walk into your house. But all right, we got to tip her and we'll unload the bag. Okay, we're going to put all the food in the fridge and you can have your poke bowl. And she was near someone that was mischievous. I'm not sure who that was. All right, then we need to work on our followers. So maybe share a joke and uh, broadcast your status. And then you can also um, add to your Instagram story. Oh, and you have mail to respond to. Okay. Lots of work you need to do. Oh, girl, you got some yellow teeth, so... Oh, you got 150 followers. All right, once you're done with all that, you're gonna, like, hop in the shower and brush your teeth. Okay, everyone needs to know you enjoyed that Diet Cola. Getting 9,000 followers. Okay, we're at 33,000 followers, which, I mean, that is very respectable. But, um, yeah, we are a long way off. So then you will get to sleep. I feel like if probably should get her a maid because she's not going to want to do the dishes herself. Although she probably wants to save up money to get a nicer apartment. All right, we are awake for the day. You have some dry skin. She's going to have her BLT and put on some lotion. You want to earn money from programming. Do you have, oh, you guys do have level five programming and you want to flatter someone. All right, well, Maybe once we get your work done for the day, we will continue trying to make friends. So far, she barely has any friendship with anyone, but she gets along okay with Miko and Emmett, but Emmett's married, and Cameron. All right, she's going to stream herself playing uh, The Refuge. All right, yeah, she is into video games, so that makes sense. Okay, wow, she gained 700 thousand followers that's impressive and you are now a notable newcomer oh and you did the dishes all on your own good job who you want to chat with salim where's salim is he outside who do we all oh those are the the fake people you can't interact with down here oh it looks like salim is going somewhere else I was thinking, once you got your work done, we would maybe invite Miko and Cameron out somewhere and just, like, hang out. She wants to give her um, apartment key to a friend. But we can also... Oh, your reputation is not that great. That's surprising. But I feel like she would definitely have networking. Because she is, you know, in social networking. And I lied. She doesn't work today. She has the day off. So, um, okay, we'll let you update your status. And then, um, yeah, we'll invite out 
your friends. All right, 25 followers. Okay, look, there's a three-person table right here. Let's have a seat. And all right, I downloaded this cafe from the gallery, so hopefully everything is working. Oh, no, why are you getting up? Okay, I guess you're getting some food. I'd say give her a compliment. Oh, you're gonna whine half-heartedly. Well, she seems like to empathize, so that's good. Okay, let's flatter her. You keep you're complaining, and it's from her being high maintenance. But I think she gets away with it from being like outgoing and all that. Like people tend to like her. Okay, and you do want to order. Oh, hi, Katrina. Okay. I mean, oh, Cameron's in here, I think. Okay, you're just reading. I thought you were maybe doing your homework. Okay, she is feeling super flirty now. I think, I'm not sure what she ordered or if you're even still getting your food. Oh, and she wants to flatter Miko. I did randomize, like, some of her preferences. So she does like men, but maybe Miko can be, like, her BFF. You're feeling flirty, and you like Cameron. Why don't you give him a compliment? Oh, Sergio, Pen hey Penny, you're so notorious that one of my unscrupulous friends has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your number? Hmm, you know what? Let's say yes. We'll see if someone calls. Okay, you want to do something romantic? <laughs> Cameron walked away. So maybe you will just do like a light flirt and see what he thinks. Although there's like other people in the conversation, so it might get awkward. Oh, he likes us. And we have the romance skill now. Okay, now you now you want to order food. Like, are we? How good of friends do you have to be to give like your apartment key? And you've been chatting with us, Evangeline, but you haven't introduced yourself, so please do that. Okay, they get along as well. Okay, let's become better friends with Miko. Why don't you uh, tell a funny story to her? Okay, she keeps trying to order something, but it's so busy here that she just, like, can't. There's just too much of a line. Oh, I think Cameron's leaving. I was just going to have her do a little bit of, like, flirting with him, because I wanted just... A little bit of romance so that maybe the game will eventually do something but nope he's leaving he didn't even say goodbye all right let's see if we can become BFFs all right let like, discuss your interests and have like a deep conversation with her you've, you've done a lot of complaining like let's get to know her okay we know that Miko is neat Okay, you keep... Stop ordering stuff. You're not even hungry. Oh, why don't you ask about her hobbies? Oh, and here's that, Emma. Oh, and Bella. Okay, Miko likes cooking. Maybe you two should be roommates. Alright, we're finding out more about Miko. She is single. She likes to cook. Um, what else? Now, ask about her career. I want to be able to give our apartment key to someone. Okay, Miko is a social justice worker. Oh, she's getting a picture with uh, Judith. Okay, and you are... You're kind of chatting with Katrina, so do a cheerful introduction. Okay, yeah, you didn't really like her. You think she's dramatic. Oh, Penny, I've heard a lot about you, mostly bad things, but that's okay. People usually don't like me either. We should hang out. How does she have a negative? Okay, it's no longer negative, but I don't get it. She's been so nice. All right, let's get to know Miko a little bit more, and then we're probably gonna head out soon. But she is feeling envious. Like, if maybe she feels like she's missing something. Probably because she's romantic and, you know, she's single. Or she doesn't even have a love interest. Oh, Miko's good. Neat and good. All right, we have made some progress on building friendships, which is good. But I think it's definitely time to leave. Like, this thing is disgusting. We don't want to get anything here anymore. Someone pranked the toilet. And, okay, no, no, you're not getting anything. We are going home. 
All right, now that you're flirty, you're feeling good, you're making friends, let's um, you know, start a funny meme. Oh, you were about to satisfy yourself. Okay. Well, we're just gonna hang out. You're not you're not streaming. You're, there's no face cam, so that's fine. It's okay to be naked in your own home. And I think she can also gain followers through um slice of life as well yeah you can post post about feeling flirty <laughs> see what your followers think about that okay oh this meme will never die Seventeen thousand five hundred. we're getting close to a million okay and that only got her 125 followers but no negative reaction and oh i guess someone walked in on you in, in the bathroom but maybe we will let her um stream a little bit play uh, let's play sims forever she doesn't have a no face cam it's fine we're not doing a nude stream then i think we'll send a flirty text to cameron and see if he asks us on a little date oh emma is calling okay he had a blast with takashi i see you're in a good mood maybe we should head out and grab a drink all right all right you put on clothes good Oh, we are in Henford on Bagley. Why don't you get to know him? Okay, he is a geek. Oh, and you got another sentiment from uh, feeling closer from happy memories. Oh, you're... don't fall. All right, let's not not chat with Tyrone. We're only chatting with Cameron. Um, express passion for romance. Okay, can you like leave? Oh, not Tyrone, Thorn. I don't know where I got Tyrone. It's like we're not even going into the bar. Wait, this is Bob. That is a getup. All right, let's do a little. Why don't you blow him a kiss? Oh yeah. And you can attempt to seduce him. I want to get at least a little bit of a romance bar. All right, you know, compliment his appearance. You do find him attractive. I hate you. Where is that coming from? Um, a bold pickup line. You are confident and flirty. And she really likes the decor out here. I think she likes the country. I think maybe in theory she likes the aesthetic, but I don't think she would like living there. Okay, now they have a little bit of room. Oh, he just disappeared. Okay. Well, okay, you want to go, you're going to go light the fire. But I was thinking maybe we head back to the city and hopefully a food stall is still open. And you can check that off your aspiration. Okay, it is open. Let's order maybe some sweet and sour eggplant. All right, so she just needs to give an apartment key to a friend and she'll have completed part of her aspiration. We got her to almost a million followers. You're having trouble with the chopsticks. But she's also, she has met a lot of people, gaining a little bit of friendship and now some romance. So she's doing good on her networking. But I think we'll leave it right here. I do want to go and see if anyone has gotten married if there's been any of the households have changed uh, with mc command center so it's been a few some days i think i forgot what days i have it set at for marriages and moving and like pregnancies so i think once we hit midnight i'll go into manage worlds and we'll see what kind of happens all right so penny's off to sleep no, she does actually work tomorrow. And, oh, you got another 150 followers. Good job. Okay, let's head into Manned Worlds and just see if anything has changed. So it looks like the Calientes. We have Lavina Chopra has moved in with Raul. And that's interesting, Dina. Oh, but uh, Nina has moved out somewhere. Oh, and... How are they elders? I didn't think Nancy and Jeffrey would be elders. I have it on long lifespan. 
Yeah, weird. Looks like um, Malcolm got married to Rahu. All right, and Kim Goldblum moved in with like Gavin Richards and Mitchell and Zoe and Ava. All right, so it's changing a little bit. I didn't see anything in Willow Creek that changed. Um, I only placed. Oh, these houses have been populated now. I will go through and add more households and community lots and all that. So it doesn't look like anything in Windenburg has really changed. But once they do get to um, for their pregnancies with six days, once they are in the second trimester, you can it'll actually show. Oh, but someone had a baby here. I guess there was someone that was already pregnant. I don't know. The save is not functioning how it usually does. Like the betas will always always have a million kids whenever I play, so that will probably happen soon. All right, so far I'm only finding like just a couple marriages, so it'll probably be need a few more days. How are these people aging like so fast? I mean, um, Penny, she was like halfway through her young adulthood already, so I don't know if that's how she usually is, but I don't know. Oh yeah, and it looks like Katarina Lynx and Knox Greenberg have gotten together. And they got all of the cats over here. Okay, it looks like only a few marriages, but I'm sure next time there'll be even more. And I like I just like seeing how the world changes. So let me know what you think in the comments, if there's any families in particular you want to see. And don't forget to hit that like button and please subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye!